What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Queen Need to be back with another food review. Today, I'm going to review the plant-based foods, fast food. So we're gonna do the Chipotle chorizo plant-based bowl. This my husband, say hi, hi, babe. He's gonna review everything with me. Then we're also gonna do the Impossible, or is it Impossible or Plant-Based Nuggets from KFC. And we're also gonna do the Impossible Slider from White Castle and the Impossible Whopper from Burger King. So y'all bear with us. We about to leave now and go pick this food up. At Burger King, y'all, I'm going around to the drive-thru right now. We are about to get the Impossible Burger. No, baby, to the Burger King. Hi, can I get your Impossible Burger? I'm sorry, this mom, we don't have any Impossible. Oh, okay, thank you. Oh, there's no Impossible Burgers here, you guys. I hope that we do not have another case with the, the Taco Bell wings. I guess we're gonna have to find another Burger King, y'all. Okay, so there happens to be a KFC right here next to the Burger King. So we're gonna go ahead and get the plant-based Beyond Nuggets. What can I get for you? Hi, can I get the six piece Beyond Chicken Nuggets? Just the nuggets. Thank you. Here we go. Chipotle. Yes. Okay, I'm in Chipotle. There's a line. We're about to get this chorizo. Okay, I want a bowl. White rice. Sour cream, uh, guacamole, and then the veggies. We got, so far, we have the Beyond Chicken Nuggets from KFC. We're gonna go try to see if we can find the Whopper and then get the Impossible Sliders from, from White Castle. Are we at Burger King and we are in line right now. We're waiting and we will see. Thank you for choosing Burger King, how can I help you? Hi, can I get the Impossible Whopper with no pickles? Do you want cheese on the sandwich? Yes. Yes, they have the Impossible Whopper. What? White Castle. We about to get up in this line so we can get these Impossible Sliders. How do you feel about these Impossible Foods? Are you ready to try them? Yes. Yeah, this is about to be interesting. Can I get two Impossible Sliders without pickles? Thank you. Sliders. Okay, so we got all the Impossible Foods or plant-based foods and we are about to go home and review them for y'all. What's up y'all, it's your girl Queen Nita B and I'm back with another food review video. We are reviewing all the Impossible Foods. We have the Beyond Chicken Nuggets. We have the Impossible Whopper. And we have the Impossible Sliders from White Castle. We also got the plant-based chorizo from Chipotle. I'm Queen Nita B. Y'all already know, this is my husband. Yeah. He's gonna try this stuff with me. We both been wanting to try it for a while. So, I was like, let's go ahead and do it together. What do you wanna start with, babe? Um, yes. Okay, let me go grab a fork. I forgot to grab a fork. All right, I got us some forks. This one, I say we could just eat it out of the thing because of the fact that, you know, this is a plant pastry, so both. And yes, we got guacamole and sour cream on it. So we're gonna try this first. Mm, let's see. Mmm. This is actually kinda good. 
Let me get a little uh, guac guacamole in there. Mm. Yeah, it's good. It's good, huh? Yeah. I actually like this. Now, this I could get with. It still has the chorizo flavor. It's not as spicy as regular chorizo. It's definitely not as greasy as regular chorizo. Yeah. It's pretty good. I like it. Mm. We both give it a thumbs up. Um, out of 10, I would give this a 9. I'm going to say a 9 because it's still... I don't, I don't know how to describe it. Like, it's not a bad texture or anything, but... It's like uh, that aftertaste. You still get that aftertaste kind of like you do with diet food or diet soda and stuff like that. What about you, babe? What it's you 10. A 10? Yeah, it's good. What? It's good. I really want to get into these nuggets. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. The nuggets came with, it comes in a green box, which this is my favorite color, lime green. So, of course, I'm going to like it. We pick ranch. So, we're going to go ahead here. Give you one. I'll take one. They feel, I don't even know. Oh, yeah. The texture just feels, <laughs> I, I, they already, they feel dry. Ain't yeah. even tasted them yet. I, yeah, it's just hard and dry. Yeah. I'm, I'm already, yeah. look, <laughs> like my commentary is already like, I, oh hell no, let me be careful. Cause last time when I did it with the nuggets, the Popeye's nuggets, I got it all over my shirt. Go ahead. <laughs> Woo. Mmm. Mm -mm. No. It's a no for me. I couldn't even chew into it. It's so hard to bite into. Like, what is that? So, from what I was reading on Google, yes, I was on Google. <laughs> don't judge me. You know, everybody go to Google when you don't know something. It says plant based food is made out of like soy protein products like tofu which has no flavor. Lentils, um, edamame, if you know what that is. My sister eats it, I do not. This is a no for me. This is a complete no for me. This was a waste of my money. Like, yeah, I can't. What you think? One. A one? Mm -hmm. It ain't even a one, it's a zero. It's a no for me. This is a zero out of one. 10. It, it's, it's okay. It don't taste like chicken to me. Like the bite was so harsh that <laughs> it was like it, it was hard to bite into it was too hard to bite into it was like really it's good though it's it's, no. it's okay it's okay like not okay <laughs> it's not okay <laughs> this shit is disgusting i wouldn't eat this i'm sorry um this is a no for me these are not good they're very tough to bite through even a mcdonald's chicken nugget is easy to bite through i don't know maybe i got the wrong nugget let's try again yeah uh-uh <laughs> Hell no. Whoa. Hell no. <laughs> Thumbs down for me. Let's get into this Whopper. Whopper with cheese. It has the uh, patty, the cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, onion. We don't like pickles, so we didn't get pickles. It looks like a regular burger. Let's go ahead and try it. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Okay, now this I could get into. Mmm. It's good. Mm-hmm. This one's really good. Me? 10. A 10 out of 10 for you? Mm -hmm. I say, I say 10 out of 10 too, actually, because of the fact that it doesn't taste like plant-based. This tastes like a regular burnt, like regular ground beef. I could get with this. Yeah, this is a 10 out of 10 for me. Thumbs up for me. So last we got the Impossible Sliders from White Castle. <laughs> yeah. It has meat and cheese and onion. Supposed to have onion, but no. they ain't got no onion. They put no onion and they added pickle, which we hate. So we're gonna go ahead and try this. Hmm. It's actually good. Maybe, I feel like they should have put the onion though. That's what's missing for me. Pickles, y'all can hold those. And it's four. A four out of 10? Yeah. It's not that great. Mm -hmm. This, I would give this a five. It's a five for me. It's good, but it's not great. And it's probably because it's missing the onions for me. Mm -hmm. Far as plant-based foods, I mean, I'm half and half. I like the chorizo. Yes. That was pretty good. Yeah. The Whopper was on hit. 
10, 10. Them nuggets mm -hmm. gotta go. Like castle, it was pretty good. I think they were all decent. I mean, I'm not against plant-based food. I can say that I am willing to try more plant-based food. The only one that was really a no for me was the mm -hmm. nuggets. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's out. But thank y'all for watching my video. I hope y'all like, share, subscribe on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, SoundCloud, everywhere y'all. Thank you babe for joining me on my video. And I'll see you guys next week with another one. Peace. Follow, subscribe, share, like. I'm gonna be Queenie to be also on YouTube.